One of my favorite things to do is you take beachy waves and then add just a little side braid. It's nice, it sort of dresses up your look. Ready? Okay. We're gonna start off this look with beachy waves. You're gonna start by taking a medium sized section of hair from the front of your head. You don't wanna take too much, otherwise it's all pulled back and it doesn't look as easy. And you don't wanna take too small of a section because then you have a very tiny little braid. So you take this portion of hair, divide it into three pieces, just as you would with any braid. And you're only gonna take a piece of hair on the top. It's basically a one-sided French braid. Braid, braid, top, braid, braid, find a piece from the top. So I usually braid it till about here. It's like maybe two inches behind my ear. Take a medium-sized pin and you're gonna pin it by going the opposite direction. Okay, braid back and then push it forward. You can use as many pins as you want. I usually just use one or two. If you have any little flyaways or pieces that stick up, you can take a tiny pin and just pin it in and hide it. Then no one knows. So for the next step, you're gonna take the Beach Blonde Sea Salt Spray. So I'm going to spray it through my hair and then work it through for texture. One of the nice things about this spray is that it gives you this great texture along with a matte finish so your hair doesn't look oily or greasy. So to finish your look, you're just gonna take some Sheer Blonde Crystal Clear Hairspray and just do a quick spray over your braid. And this is great because it locks in your style but it doesn't dull your color. So just do that so your little braid holds. And your look is complete. Thanks for watching. Check out the John Frieda social channels for more videos like this.